Helen Flanagan accompanied Claire Sweeney for the Thursday restaurant debut of the Ivy's Liverpool, looking dapper, for the event. The 34-year-old former soap star wore a form-fitting bandeau dress with a large satin bow on one shoulder. She wore her hair in gentle curls and accessorized the festive ensemble with a pair of silver stiletto heels. Claire, 53, looked stunning in a gold gown covered in sequins that hung down the front and curled around her waist. The actress added a slick of crimson lipstick and a pair of adorned heels to finish off her ensemble. Helen later put on a fur coat as she and her boyfriend, Robbie Talbot, left the restaurant. His daughter Sophie, dressed in a lovely pink frock, joined the couple. Robbie's children from a prior relationship are Sophie, 14, and Karina, 10 while Helen's children from her previous relationship with ex-fiancé Scott Sinclair are Matilda, 9, Delilah, 6, and Charlie, 3. Despite having three children together, Helen has disclosed that her ex-fiancé has blocked her. After 13 years of dating, four of which were spent engaged, the actress and Scott, 35, called it quits in 2022. They have three kids together. For the first time last month, Helen publicly discussed the breakup, stating that the two weren't compatible. You read so much about how you don't need a partner to make you happy. She remarked on the podcast The Life of Bryony. No, I don't need a man to make me happy. But being in a healthy relationship with a toxic one really f asterisk 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 g helps. According to Helen, she and Scott had an unhealthy relationship. With all due respect to my children's father, I've had three children with him and I always feel a great deal of affection for him. Although we are both decent individuals, our relationship was extremely toxic. I believe that being in a toxic relationship can seriously harm your emotional well-being, particularly when you already have mental health issues. I mean I'm currently blocked on Scott's phone. Yes I am. I'm blocked. We give each other our all. However you and I always have a certain amount of respect for one another, so I know he's not a bad guy we're just dealing with our own problems. I also know he will always love me, and I believe that because we were together from a very young age, we were only 19, we simply didn't work out because we didn't have the time to mature before we broke up. Eight months after they started dating, Robbie moved into the former Coronation Street star's house last month. He's fantastic, she answered when Bryony asked her about her new relationship. Everyone adores him. He and I met at a bar just now. It was impossible for me to stop giggling at this person. My boyfriend is actually the funniest guy I've ever met, she continued. He has two children and is incredibly lovely with them. He's really amazing at helping me with my mental health issues, which is what I need most. So I guess that's what made me fall even more in love with him. I've realized that my top priority is to find someone who is good for me both emotionally and mentally. With all due respect to my children's father, I will always love him but he didn't know how to handle me or how to do that, and not everyone does. That's why I'm happy with the man I'm with now, because he truly knows how to do that.